Hi, welcome back to Rebecca's Travels, or if you're watching my lifestyle channel, welcome back to Rebecca's Lifestyle. Hi, how are you all doing? I hope everybody's having as good weekend as possible. Um, the weather um, has been cold um, in the UK, and um, it's been cloudy um, in northwest Leicestershire. Um, I hope there's no more snow on any snow on the way, but um, again, that we, I've been told that there is snow on the way, um, but hopefully not. Um, next week. Um, so today I'm going to be doing a luxury travel news special: ten exciting facts, March two thousand twenty-three, part one. Hi, if you're new here to my channel, please subscribe. I'm always looking for um, new subscribers and um, and a big th a thumbs up and thank you for doing so. Now, um, according to tgmedia.com, um, the following 10 fantastic brand new uh, facts, luxury travel facts slash luxury, you can... Um, read more about uh, these sto uh, stories that I'm going to tell you um, on that website ttgmedia.com slash luxury so I'm going to fire away with the first fact uh, Banyan Tree um, to open first Agnesana Resort in Spain wow new luxury development in Marbella is due to open in uh, 2026. The new resort uh, located uh, with the Rio de la Quinta development um, will offer 90 room and suite when it is open. The hotel will have three dining venues including all day dining, wow, signature restaurant and pool bar and grill. Other facilities uh, will include a spa, kids club, adult and, fa and family pool and um, a wedding amphitheatre. Wow, that's absolutely amazing. Sounds absolutely wonderful. Um, I've also been to Mar Bella and um, it is a, a lovely resort um, in the Costa del Sol, Spain. Um, number two, uh, Pond Nunt um, introduces um, skiing polar trek um, in Greenland. Wow, that's brand new. I hope that goes as well as possible and um, the new luxury hotel. And any other um, um, like activities, resorts, etc., restaurants for the hospitality section around the world. Um, number three, Regent um, Hong Kong reveals first glimpse of new rooms ahead of its grand opening in June 2023. The feature an open plan layout with several rooms offering sliding doors to reveal harbour views uh, from freestanding bathtubs bathtub restaurants also uh, to offer harbour site uh, buffet experience experience wow and a lobby lounge um, The exciting restaurant to return to its original name of Lang Chang Heen. Excuse my pronunciation. So that sounds really ex um, exciting, um, the region for Hong Kong. It looks absolutely fantastic. And number four, Elegant Resort unveils new wellness collection. So I hope that goes as well as possible for the elegant um, resort. 
and uh, number five uh, Group A Bazaar opens um, 12 Bazaari uh, Frank hits so I hope that event or the Bazaari um, Frank hits uh, goes as well as possible for the Group A Barari, excuse my pronunciation. And uh, number six, um, LNR Hotels launches a countryside eco retreat in Devon, obviously the UK. And um, it sounds amazing. And um, the main resort is situated on. Um, a 25 acre site and it's going uh, and it's open from the 27th of February this year so wow it, it sounds really exciting number seven Caribbeaters launches agent recognition program 27th of February um this year so that sounds exciting i hope it goes as well as possible for car reputers and um the travel agents recognition program and um, number eight hotel indigo um plan to open a sixth property in london uk wow that's a uh, that sounds amazing. I hope it goes as well as possible for Hotel in Digo. And uh, number nine, Auberge Resorts Collection adds two new European properties. Um, and they are based in France and Italy. Wow. That's uh, so Aubergine uh, or Aubergine. The resorts collections on the up it looks like which is really good and i hope the two new properties in france and italy go as well as possible uh, for the operator and the countries last but not least the safari collection introduces a helicopter safaris wow uh, that sounds really exciting the Safari Collection in Kenya has launched a new helicopter Safari experience giving a guest the chance to explore remote and wide areas in the north of the country Kenya. That sounds absolutely spectacular and amazing. So it's offering another type of Safari sahari experience i hope that goes as well as possible for the country kenya and um the safari collection so i would like to say thank you for watching and um i'll see you tomorrow for my uh, travel and my lifestyle channels improvements updates and more and um i hope everybody's had as good weekend as possible or is having as good weekend as possible thank you and bye for now thank you bye